Tracking coronavirus hotspots, Hillsborough County leaders are taking action to expand testing to the areas that need it the most, and all with the help of a survey. Good evening and thank you for joining us. I'm Isabel Rosales. Our McKenna King shows us the reason county leaders urge everyone to fill out that survey. The survey looks like this. It asks you questions like whether or not you've had symptoms of COVID-19 or been in contact with someone who has. It also asks you questions regarding your location. That's something county leaders say will help them identify the hotspots. It's called the Symptom Surveillance System, developed by researchers at USF to help the county narrow down those areas of higher transmission. So it's a way of helping them target the testing and sort of know where the problems are. Current maps like the ones from the Florida Department of Health show those hotspots based on positive cases, but this survey acts as a supplement. There's been uh, issues around um, the number of people who are able to be tested. Uh, you have to have a specific set of uh, symptoms to be tested. Identifying areas with higher symptoms, making rapid tests available to those people, and tracing their contacts are steps the White House says are crucial before our states begin reopening. The next stage, the nice thing to do would be to able to start open up. And as we open up, we can identify where new cases are and then quarantine those new cases and the people they've come in contact with. And then let the other 90% of the population go back and start to try and get back to a normal life. Hillsborough County working to secure rapid tests by May 1st. And county leaders say while they work to launch steps toward reopening, businesses can develop their own plans for when that day comes. Any business that wants help from the county to help them reopen, is going to be required to use face coverings and appropriate actions in accordance to FEMA and the CDC. The USF survey is currently available across Hillsborough, Pasco, Pinellas, Polk, and Manatee counties. You can find a link to that survey on our website, abcactionnews.com virus. Reporting in Tampa, McKenna King, ABC Action News.